Stamps from Grandpa, written and illustrated by Karolina Serendenko. Stamps could be small and big, round and rectangular, shiny and colourful. But the most incredible stamps I've ever seen are the ones I've received from my grandpa. He has sent to me so many greeting cards, each with the special stamp on it, since the day I was born. Even though I could not read yet, Grandpa wanted me to know how much he loved me and that there would be lots of things for me to discover and practice once I learn how to read and write by myself. My mother and father were reading the cards to me. They even told me that when I was very little, this helped me to fall asleep sometimes, travelling through my dreams on my trusty scooter. I was always so excited to receive my next card that I was looking at all the postmen on the streets that we were seeing sometimes in town, thinking that they could have a new card from my grandpa in their special bag. The extra special stamps I was getting for my birthdays, my first, second, third, and now I am a big boy. This year I turned four and received a whole letter. Grandpa sent a second letter to me right before I was about to start my first day at school, wishing me to enjoy my new friends, of course, to listen to my teacher, and be always open to new discoveries. Never to forget to smile to everyone, always to be kind, never to give up, but to always try my best. To help and to protect the little ones, you know, those who are smaller than me. To be gentle with animals and respect nature around me and to learn to write as quickly as I can so I can write to my grandpa my first letter too. So today is my first day of school and I am very curious to find out about all the exciting things that Grandpa mentioned to me. Senda Grandpa, Land of Windmills, 27 Tulips Lane, 2014, right back soon. To my dear grandson, Land of Big Ben, 4 Lucky Clover, 2020 Prince of the Castle. Press the button below to subscribe, like and share. I hope you've enjoyed it. See you next time.